this is the log cabin room. A lot of very magical things have happened in this room. My mother's spirit came here, and so did Jacqueline Dupre, her spirit. Uh, Larry Gowan came here to uh, have an after concert reception, and we all were sitting on the bed in here. <laughs> These pictures of Walter and I have been on the wall since we first met 16 years ago. Nothing's changed. There's some pictures of my friend Emily Samarsay and the card that she gave me, a beautiful Native American card with a horse, Rocky St. Marie signed picture in this little window that used to open out onto the outside of the house which had a porch surrounding it and now it's our sunroom on the other side of the wall so I just left this it's just a little storage cupboard now and uh, those are my mom's paintings at the top there they were still wet when I saw them, their oil paintings, and I just fell in love with them and had to have them, so she let me take them home. And keep the books that we're reading at the other end of the bed. There's our friend Jan's books. And these two beautiful little girl dolls, little they're in their ragged clothing. And my Steiff bear, which I've had forever. Little rabbit. And cute little witch there. It's not Halloween, but she hangs there all the time. And this little horse was given to me by one of my former students and friend. And oh my gosh, who must, must have gotten that? 25 years ago or something like that. A little marionette horse. Get our little twinkle lights up. And then this is where I keep all my just put a string from one end of the mirror to the other. Actually I, I made this mirror. It was an old window and I stripped it and replaced it with mirror panels. And so it makes the room look bigger. And I can use it for keeping my jewelry on. Nothing very expensive, just... And then I've got some of the pictures of my friends that I've known for my, most of my life. That's my horse. Another picture of Buffy. We've seen several concerts by her. An early picture of Walter and I when we first got together. My beautiful brother, who's now passed. And... Kind of hard to see in here. That's my string quartet. We're sitting in a... I think it's a BMW. This is some needlepoint that my... Um, my nephew's wife, Susan, did. It's absolutely beautiful. It's got some beautiful sayings on it. The reflection kind of makes it hard to see, but it's a lot of work and it's just beautifully done. And the store was all painted when I moved in here and I stripped it. I did a lot of stripping, paint stripping. <laughs> so my horse's eye up here, it's kind of hard to see. There we go. And that's a painting that I did of me and my dog who's passed. She could see spirits. She was an amazing, sensitive dog. You coming in, Tashi? 
There he goes. Tashi likes to come in here. This is his favorite room in the house, right? Is this your favorite room? Yeah? Okay, and there's Mitsu. Everybody has been waiting on the other side of the door so they could come in here. And this is a Mennonite uh, wardrobe. Or not wardrobe, but drawers. And I keep the books on the top. And this is my new nativity scene <coughs> that I just got. It uh, it lights up. It's got a little button at the back. Hey, you're making a lot of noise there, bud. <coughs> and if I turn that off, let's see here. It looks like that. Put on the light. You can see it a little better. Looks like crystal, but it's just. Uh, um, acrylic so it glistens and it catches the colors just like glass it was absolutely stunning and I got that at Metropolitan United Church they were auctioning off a whole collection of nativity scenes to raise money for the church I guess a pastor had passed away and left his whole collection to them to auction off and that's it that's our magical cabin room. I just love it in here. Always wanted to have a cabin. Figured I probably never would, so why not turn one one room into a cabin? Yes, Tika? Mm -mm -mm. You guys are so cute. Yes, you are. <laughs>